joined by head men's basketball coach Brooks McCowan. Coach, congratulations on a big win last night. Uh, a lot of emotions, I bet. What, what were you feeling throughout the game? Uh, there was a lot of emotions. It was kind of a roller coaster game. Um, we didn't start very well to start the game. Uh, a lot of that goes out to the way Duluth played when they came in the gym. They, they were ready to go. Uh, they made a lot of shots. They made some tough shots. We also left them open for some pretty easy ones to get them going. Um, but then we kind of picked it up. You know, the last five minutes of the first half, our guys uh, really turned a corner and just played like a different basketball team. And, and then that led us into the second half where we were able to keep uh, just kind of cutting the lead, cutting the lead. Uh, we'd make a run, they'd score a couple, we'd make another run uh, to where then where we uh, were able to take the lead and, and to finish the game out. And, uh, you know, I'm proud of our guys, the way they competed. They didn't give up. Uh, the crowd was a big aspect in it. The, this place was rocking last night. It, it was a lot, a lot of fun, a great atmosphere, and I do feel like that got us through uh, to the end of the game. Now, Joey Woods was a big reason you guys pulled off the victory. He scored a game high, 22 points. Uh, he earned NSIC all NSIC first team honors today. What does that mean for him and this team? Uh, he was. He's been so good for us all year long, and um, Joey has gotten so much better as the year went on. I give Joey a lot of credit. I'm proud of how much he's matured as a man and, and as a basketball player. Um, he just does everything he can to win. Um, and that kid, he, we just give him the ball at the end of the games. So, uh, we're going to put it in his hands. And, and a couple times they took him away last night, and other guys were able to step up. But our guys have so much confidence in him, and, and that's because of what he's done all year long and, and how far he's come with this team. And, and he is one of our leaders of this team and, and definitely deserves the, the honor that he got on the first team. It's a good first team. Uh, you look at the list with him with all the players, and it's some great basketball players. And, and you're going to have that in a league like this with this many teams and, and this many good teams. But uh, that's a great honor for Joey, uh, but well-deserved. Last but certainly not least, how do you guys keep playing in the NSIC tournament? How do you beat Moorhead this Saturday in the quarterfinals? Uh, we're just going to have to play our game. Uh, Moorhead is a very good basketball team. Obviously, it was a, a shootout last time we played them. Um, both teams getting over 100 and kind of the last team to have the ball uh, was able to win it. And that was us. We were fortunate to get out of there with a win. Um, but we're just going to have to play our game. You know, we're going to have to try to do some different things to stop them um, and make their offense tough on them. But they got a very good basketball team. Uh, there's a reason they they had a co-share of the lead um, for the conference title. And there's a reason they beat a lot of good teams this year. So we're going to have to go in and play a good basketball game. and. Um, stick to our principles defensively and, and then offensively just stay aggressive. We need to start a little more aggressive than we did uh, last night. I, I felt like we were kind of on our heels to start the game last night, but um, we need to go out and attack and just play our game. Thanks, Coach, and good luck. Thank you.